Ejinde. Well, Who should be responsible for allowing this to happen? Well, uh, thank you very much, Kafui. First and foremost, when I saw it, I felt very offended as a Ghanaian. I felt very offended as a Ghanaian because uh, just behind GBC here, yeah. the Netherlands Embassy there, mm -hmm. there's a big sign, no photography, thank even you. from outside. This is an embassy, mm -hmm. not the seat of government. Mm -hmm. I don't think anybody can get close to the White House even try to take pictures. Go to the American embassies. Go to all the embassies here. You can't even get close. Cut your You can't take photos. So please, I think whoever uh, decided that this guy should be allowed to take footages of our seat of government, I think uh, the person should, uh, should be brought to answer certain questions. Mm -hmm. Because in the first place, that area is a security zone. Yeah. And I've also been there a few times. Mm -hmm. They take their phones and everything, they take it away. Exactly. Then I ask myself, if I cannot have access to, if I cannot go with my phone, as a Ghanaian, why should a foreigner be allowed? You see, the whole thing is that Ghanaians, we've made ourselves so cheap <clears throat> that we respect foreigners, we accord them the respect that we don't give our own people. So what makes anybody think that this guy can take his whatever, go there and then video and i a ghanian full-blooded ghanian i cannot even take my my, my phone inside mm -hmm. what is this what are we doing to ourselves so first and foremost i think that those who are advising the president on matters of security they should be brought to ask certain to answer certain questions and to quote my brother kuku and jindy hood has my role i'm done mr Fripol. <laughs> well the same you understand, uh, if the president is the first gentleman of the land, then that house becomes the first house of the <laughs> land. And I'm surprised that anybody at all, whether foreigner or Ghanaian, could be allowed into that place to take photographs, to make video. I believe that it is, uh, as somebody said, it is a desecration of the highest order. And I believe that if Koku Anyudoho said it, I would agree with him <laughs> that... Uh, it should be investigated thoroughly because you cannot expect the president to be responsible for his own security and be responsible for that huge mansion. There are a lot of people responsible who allowed that thing to go on and such people should be heavily reprimanded.